don't have to be a superstar athlete to experience a major league injury, but you can thank sports medicine for helping you heal better and quicker. There's no question that, that the high-level athlete has been over time what's driven orthopedics to the level we're at today. Historically, war and war injuries spurred orthopedics using plates and screws to rebuild bodies. In recent years, it's been battles in the sports arena. The elite level athlete and the demands and rigors that they're going to face in their daily game initiated a lot of these type of technologies. Our aging athletes get the highest level of technology that's available to Tiger Woods or Tom Brady. 50% of shoulder repairs are now done arthroscopically. Instead of cutting the body and slicing through muscle, surgeons now use slender tools and operate through small holes. Rotator cuffs and labral tears are common shoulder injuries in both top-level athletes and everyday Joes. What happens is the tendon tears off of the bone, and when that happens, it causes pain and lack of function. Using arthroscopic tools, surgeons reattach the tendon to the bone and use next-gen healing aids. We have good uh, sutures that we use now. We have these things called suture anchors, which go into the bone, and they're the anchoring point for reattaching the uh, tendon. Researchers are also seeking new ways to jumpstart the body's own recovery process. We are trying to uh, work on some advances in things like platelet-rich plasma, other biological mediators, which can help speed some of this healing. Always pushing the envelope, sports medicine is helping people regain their best form. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.